In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to redirect your domain to another domain. Now, why might you want to do this? Well, perhaps you have renamed your business and you want to redirect your old business's website to your new domain name, or perhaps you've redesigned your website and you want to redirect your old website to your new website under a new domain. So let's get straight into it. The first thing you are going to want to do is log into your domain registrar or your website's hosting account. So for this tutorial, we are going to be using Verpex hosting, which you can check out using the link in the description, but they're all going to be fairly similar depending on which domain registrar or which web hosting you're using. The layout and the steps that we are going to take are going to be fairly similar. So if you are with Verpex, you can simply click on web hosting and we are gonna navigate to the control panel. But like I say, it doesn't really matter what web hosting provider you're with, you can go to the control panel and this is where you are going to redirect your domain to another domain. So we are gonna click on log into control panel. And once you are logged into your control panel, you can scroll down to domains and you will see redirects. So we are going to click on redirects and then you can simply add a redirect. So you can add a permanent redirect or a temporary redirect. So a permanent redirect, it's pretty straightforward. It means that you permanently want your domain to redirect to the new domain. So search engines will actually pick this up and they will start indexing that your domain has been redirected. However, if you are just temporarily revamping your site and you want to redirect your site to another site in the meantime, you can go and add a temporary redirect. And again, search engines, we will be able to read this. We're gonna go for a permanent one. You can then choose the domain that you want to redirect to a new domain. So we're just going to choose this domain name here. You can go and choose a path as well, so a certain page that you want to redirect. We're just gonna go for the whole website. And then you can choose the redirects too. So you can go and enter in a domain name in here. So we're just going to enter in this domain name as the redirect domain. Make sure that you have copied the domain name directly from the URL so that it includes HTTPS and everything. Then you can go and choose the direction. So you can choose only redirect with www, redirect with or without www, or do not redirect www. I recommend to go for redirect with or without, which means either way, whenever someone types in your old domain's name, they will be redirected to the new domain. Don't worry about wildcard redirect. You can then simply click on add. You will then see this green tick to indicate that the redirect has been completed. So you can click on go back. And now if you scroll down, you will see the redirect here. You can of course delete it at any point, but once that has been completed, your old domain will now redirect to your new domain. It can take a couple of hours for this to kick in. So just give it some time if it doesn't redirect straight away. But after a couple of hours, you can go and test your old domain and it should redirect straight to the new domain name. So that is how you can redirect a domain to another domain. I hope you have enjoyed the video. If you have, give it a big thumbs up and make sure to subscribe to the channel for more WordPress and website related tutorials. This has been Elliot with Verpex and hopefully I'll see you in the next one.